Hi, everybody. We have a new ground for you, the Wanda Metropolitano, the new home of Atletico Madrid. Martin Tyler here, along with Alan Smith. Quite a call by the board of directors of Atletico Madrid to up sticks from the Vicente Calderon and to come to this state-of-the-art stadium. It's very good, and I'm sure they'll enjoy it here, the fans particularly. Well, they can be really the heartbeat of the team, these central midfield players, and we've got a new one making his debut today. What do you make of it, Alan? Well, I'm um, impressed by the signing. I think he'll give them a bit more composure in the middle of the park. He can get up and down, and he's a good pass for the ball. This is the home team lineup. Ivan Rakitic plays with Bruno in central midfield, and they'll play with a sole striker. This is how the visitors shape up. Probably one of the two front men will slip behind the other and, and augment the midfield when required. I think so, if they start getting overloaded in the middle of the park, that's always an option for this manager who does like to fill his midfield. whether that will change both managers' approach to this game. It's a really good goal from a player who prefers it with the other foot. It does. I enjoy mean, mad sometimes when players won't take a chance on the weaker side, so fair play to him for doing that. that kind of goal because it was a real team effort the way they moved the ball about and once it came to the finish it was an unerring effort he can't have scored many better than this with the bend he's imparted onto the ball well give him credit you could see exactly what he set out to do there and executed it perfectly going to have to give way to the injury it's forcing the manager to make a change he's hunted down the defender this could be it Carvajal and he scores spectacularly range but you've got to be there to score you've got to be there to miss it as well but he didn't Well, he might be a defender by name, but he's got an attacker's instincts, as this shows. Well, his teammates are all over him. They know he's capable of doing that. I think he does it plenty of times in training, but this one's valuable. Surprisingly well, Coco. Well, whichever direction the defender sends him, he seems capable of adjusting. Well, it's a goal worth replaying over and over again, isn't it? Hurt and can't continue. Rion. 
Well, the away team will be interested in this because the home side are now defending with a clear offside trap. Well, they've laid down a marker. Can they get through now, the opposition? Pedro, they scored! Well, they've taken the low route here and they've got themselves a goal well out of the keeper's range. But you've got to be there to score. You've got to be there to miss it as well, but he didn't. They are playing well. Their superiority increased really with this goal. Well, you can only see more goals coming their way the way they played. Swung in from the corner. Struck the post here. Only partially. Shot on. You never like to see this. One team being beaten by so many goals. Well, he's doubled up here with his second goal. And he took it in excellent style, just like the first one. be a throw not a corner although some thought otherwise stopped emphatically and just as well the approach play looked very encouraging Marcos Alonso playing at home I think they feel that they can work the offside trap today yeah this is a system I think they're comfortable with Martin the shot's on and it's a goal here 